welcome to one of the most iconic mountains in Scotland, Stack Polly. Right, this is Stack Valley Car Park. Uh, this is the start of our walk. Um, before we get going, um, let's just have a look at the route from above. Okay. From the Stack Valley Car Park, we go through the trees and make our way up to the Deer Gate. Once through the Deer Gate, we head north up a winding path. The path starts to steepen as we approach the rear of Stack Polly. The path then starts to get even more steeper as we reach the final ascent onto the backbone of the mountain. From the top of Stack Polly summit the views are absolutely breathtaking. Right, here we go. It's um, about 14 degrees. But uh, there's no wind at all. It's a great little path to start with. Great views already. Great view over to Cognac. This glimpse of Stack Pollock, bit of uh, mist going over. Fingers crossed again that uh, it clears. Maybe it just comes and goes, hopefully. Good path up is this to Stack Polly. It's pretty well laid out, steps and that. So, a lot of midges down in the bottom. So, I'm glad to get up here. <laughs> Look at that for a view. Right. We'll go around back of there to get up. So, some people just going up now. Just starting to clear. Oh good. That looks really good as that. Just a quick view back. Like. Up down there, this is where we just come up. And then just a view back around there.
started to get steeper now um, it's just got covered in mist again but uh, it'll clear time I get up there <laughs> clearer over that side well cognacking but the smaller hills is clear okay up we go in the cloud. That's a Corbett mountain. Path starts to steepen a bit now but um, it's well laid out so it's a big thanks to the people who's done all this work laying this out. This makes it a lot easier to climb up. Stack ball is clear now. Let's hope it stays that way. <laughs> okay, upwards and onwards. Looks unclimbable up front. Actually, it has a bit of a sullen look to it at the front. Same kind of rock, so. Yeah, it's uh, weather's picking up and getting better and better now. Just a bit more uphill and then it sort of goes round the corner and then you cut up the middle. So it's not a long walk. If you start at probably about eight, nine o'clock, you'll be back for over lunchtime. If you want to stop up and stay and look at the views then take the day. That's Coinyak again. Kulbiag, that's a Corbett mountain over there with all the cloud on it. You can climb it either from this front or, or the other side or do a circular. Okay. Just stop for a cup of tea. And my word, what a view stop. That lock there, I cannot um, pronounce it, so I'll put it on the screen what it is. It's a tongue twister. So we'll spin around, and over there's Culmore, which is um, another core, but I've done that a couple of times. I might be filming, filming it this time. Here's the path that I just come up. And what a view over there. It's, it's um nice breeze and no midges. Right, I'll finish my drink and then we're not far to start climbing up because we're on the southeast side now of Stack Polly. Over and out. Getting warmer. Probably one of the best lunch stops in Britain. The Wilderness of Ascent over there. You can see the sea just about. That's solvent in cloud, but you can see it on a clear day if you look at one of my other videos. I'm not plugging it. That's Culmore and Culbeg or Culbeg. Could sit here all day looking at this. Beautiful view. A wilderness. 
sandwich term. Uh, now we're on the eastern eastern side of Stack Bollet, so one big push up there now, and then up onto the summit. Okay. Bye for now. Here we are, look at this, cognac over there, and the sea, the summer isles in the far distance, beautiful place, spent a lot of time in summer isles, that's the car park, and uh, this is the view from the other side. Gonna climb up there later, but first I'm gonna go up onto the trick point, which is that way. Okay, bye for now. Start to climb up here. The trick point is up that way. I can't remember if we can get this way to the trick point, so we'll just give it a try. Looks pretty steep. So many paths up this um, mountain, so I'm going to try this way. Yeah, found a different way. Like I said, there's that many different ways to climb up this, but always find the safest way. Up there we go. Hey. It's not as bad as what it looks, but if you're scared of ice, don't, don't come this way. You'll have to uh, skim the side of the hill. So, right, up onto this next ridge. Whoa, look at that. Great views. That's our path. It carries on. Not for the fair darted. Like I said, these paths, they're all over. Pretty hard to navigate in mist, I bet. And it's uh, getting misty now. And here it is. <laughs> Stack Polly! Yay, the summit. Wow. Just give you a pan round, even though the clouds come in. <laughs>
can just come over this side to show you um, Stack Poly, the steep cliffs that would be for rock climbers not something I'd like to do um, gonna go back that way down that path so it's gonna be a um, what is it anti-clockwise walk yeah it is uh, so follow that path down there and all the way down to where the car park is there so it's a great little circular clouds coming in so we'll get going one last view at the sea over and out Probably getting back down now it's a bit dodgy on here but I won't like to do it when it's um, wet Whoa. easy does it <laughs> Right, there's the path that um, will take us back anti-clockwise but those who want to um, not do the anti-clockwise route just join the path and follow the same way back as you came to the car park okay we'll get down here one last look at the view before we get down wow okay Right, round the corner on the west side of um, Stack Folly now. Um, not far back down to the car. A bit muddier this way than the other way, but if you have a decent pair of boots, you should be having no problems at all. Over and out. Finally back, back to the path. So I did a full circuit there. So back to the car now. I hope you enjoyed that. I did. Got lucky with the views up there as well with the clouds. So okay. Uh, as usual, if you've liked the video, give us a like. Or um, if you want to subscribe to my channel, more videos coming up in the future. Or even leave us a comment. So I'll say goodbye from Stack Polly and I'll see you on the next one. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye.